Shalom, everyone. Peace and blessings. It is time for us to become more aware of what is truly going on around us. Our health is our wealth. What good does it do to cure someone of something if you can make money off of keeping them sick? Why do we go to remedies for after we have illnesses instead of implementing prevention methods so we do not contract these illnesses? Most of us do not control our own food source. We have to go through supermarkets, um, grocery stores in order to get our food, which is coming from, in some cases, more than a thousand miles away. It's more serious than we realize. Six chemical companies own 90% of the seeds that are used for production, for agricultural production. These, this is important because these companies are creating seeds that are dependent on other chemicals that they make, which are known to cause illnesses and ailments, which in return they also make additional chemicals to treat these illnesses that are caused by the chemicals that they are using to grow our food. There's a conflict of interest there. For those of us that are conscious of this and are aware of this, it is time that we make the rest of the world aware. We need to get more into urban agriculture and educating the youth as far as where their food comes on, how to be self-sustaining, community sustaining, getting together in your community and talking about these health issues. A lot of these high blood pressure, high cholesterol, diabetes, hypertension, these are food related illnesses. We are killing ourselves. When will enough be enough? We have an opportunity right now to take things back into our own hands. But we must have the will and the drive and the desire to survive. Not only for us, but for future generations. Look at the chemicals that are in these foods that you are buying. We have Google. Use it. We are being killed slowly and milked for as much profit as possible. Choices. Life is full of choices. With out perfect information you're not going to necessarily always make the right choices but once you gain additional information cater your choices towards that be aware don't be a sitting duck don't be a pawn take control of your life be used to help spread this information unto other people y'all bless Baruch Hashem Yahuwah, Baha Hashem Yahusha HaMashiach. Blessed is the holy name of Yahuwah and his son's name Yahusha. I'm an Israelite. I love my father. And even if you are a stranger, it's because I'm an Israelite. That doesn't mean that I hate all people and I think white people are the devil because that's not the case. Good and bad people come in many different colors and shades. Anyone that's willing to follow my, follow my father's statutes, laws, and commands, even if you're a stranger, you're good with me. Love your father with all your heart, soul, and mind, and love your neighbor as you love yourself. We are all humans. We all need food. We all need food to survive. So we have to come together and put these differences and things that separate us aside in order for us to be able to sustain living. So hallelujah. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hua.